Hi guys, how are you doing? We're outside Triton Fountain. I'm gonna have a walk around. Uh, main aim is to go and see this museum. There's a, a carnival museum. Uh, I've never seen it before. And I'm watching, wondering if this is the first time. Anyway, it's uh, sun's going down a little bit. It's about quarter past four. We're gonna walk through the letter. See, uh, this is the eve of the carnival, the kids carnival tomorrow. So. We we'll see if anything special is happening or if they've done anything. There is like a couple of bandstands up there. There's the buses over there. That's the bus terminus, if nobody knows. Let's walk down the letter. We'll go down to uh, St. George Square. we we'll see if they've got all the standouts because the, the kids, as I say, the kids carnival, then it's Saturday and Sunday is the main carnival. Let's go and have a look, guys. <laughs> Museum. It's new, it's at uh, St. James Cavalier, but I just noticed a monstrosity. I, I wasn't seeing that before, but I think on one of the videos there was something. Up here, look. What the hell is that? There's a plaque on the wall. So, let's see what the plaque says. It's the Royal, oh, that's the Royal Opera House. That's the plaque to the Royal Opera House. Here's the Opera House, guys. It was uh, burned down many years ago and direct hit from the Germans. That's the history. But here is this. My God, what the hell is it? That's cost money. <laughs> if my taxpayers' money has gone into that. What a load of rubbish. I don't even know what it is. What the hell? No idea. Anyway, we're on our way to St. James Cavalier. It's a lovely part of the letter at the back here. The operas. Maybe, maybe one day. It'll get rebuilt. Who knows? They have some concert there sometimes. I don't know exactly what goes on. I'm not in the letter all the time, but they do something. Oh, this was the parliament here, if you didn't know. We do a mini tour on the way to St. James Cavalier to the Auberge de Castile, which is up on the top there. It's opposite, it's part of the, just over the top of when the first bricks was laid in, in uh, Belletta. By, you're gonna see him in a minute. The King of Belletta. Belletta himself, look there. I always come and have a look at him. What a great man, huh? to have a vision to build a great city. A city built by gentlemen, for gentlemen. <laughs> Here he is, look, Valletta. This is quite a historic part of Valletta, because you've got the French uh, church here, Auberge de Castillo, and that wonderful church there, look, had the, just at the back, I'm not sure where it was, but around by the altar, was the first brick laid by Valletta. Thus ends your history lesson. We went in that church, we've got some, we've got a video of it. Wonderful church. Let's see what the, you can see the pictures. There's a, oh, all sorts of things. I can't even remember the amount of things that a guy was telling me. There's these different altars. And that's the foundation that takes care of it. 100 years. So this is the Lady of Victory Church. 
St. James Cavalier just around the corner here. If that's where it is, because I'm not 100% sure, we just saw it in the programme. But it's quite big. At the back there was the first brick. I don't think anybody knows where it is. Oh, there's the Castile here, Prime Minister's office. And where the, uh, I think it was a mixture of, was a mixture of Italian and Portuguese? I, I can't ring, I can't remember now. The, the Knights of St. John was there anyway. But they had a lot, they had about five auberges. Auberges is like a gentleman's club. So this is the official old post office. What is it here somewhere? Malta's National Centre for Creativity. I'm going to check because I thought it was here. Let me have a walk around and I'll check if it's here. Could be this one. Free entrance. Let's cut off for a minute. Let's find out. Okay. Oh, from the other side? Okay. Thank you. Oh, so it's not here. This is another museum. But we have to go down the stairs, she said. From here. It's big in here. I've never been around here. St. James Cavalier. It's a, a place where a lot of uh, artists are here. So let's have a look. The Carnival Museum. Oh, how beautiful. The first time I've been here, guys. How oh, nice. They've really done this nice. How spectacular. So she said downstairs. Let's have a quick look over here. Hey, how nice. How nice is this? And that's how the original wall is uh, on the other side. Obviously, let's see where we come going. It's quiet, guys. I thought there'd be a queue for this. <laughs> Completely lost. Let's cut off a minute, guys. I'll have a walk around. Really, there's a carnival museum, but it's enormous here. But there's a creative as well here. So it's costumes. Oh yeah, this is nice, huh? Nice, eh? Costumes, eh? So this is like the old costumes of quiet though here. Yeah. Nobody's come to. I expect it says museum in the uh, What do you think guys? We play some kind of music going around. Hey, that's a smart one. If you get a chance, come and have a look. If you can find it, that is. It's, <laughs> it's very difficult to find. Hey, this one's neat. This is like a kid's one. Wow, these are like the old balconies, eh? How nice. It's very hard to find, though. It's a massive, I never imagined it this big, this place. So these are the old carnival costumes, so it's not actually a museum. 
It says on the program, Carnival Museum. And what a place this is. Very interesting. Oh. So I don't know. That's about it, I think. Interesting, though. I think that's it guys. <laughs> Celebration and families. Do we get out from here? That's what we want to know. Oh, yeah. So, not what I expected. On the program it said uh, Carnival Museum. But still, it was worth looking at, eh? Fantastic views. I'll show you this while we're here. While we're in Valletta. We we'll do a bit of a mini tour. I'll show you from here the waterfront. Then we'll go down to St. George Square, see what's going on down there. They said we're doing uh, later on, but I don't think I've got a chance to wait. He says we're doing like a, a dance or something later on. But most of the uh, things start tomorrow anyway. Let's have a look from here. Not bad. After a. was a nice start to the day. Then it clouded over and the evening is finishing quite nice. Here's the waterfront guys. Nice view of the uh, Grand Harbour and the ditch down there. So let's go and have a look. This is the eve of the, car of the carnival. I was just interested. I wasn't far away and I thought, let's go and see if there's anything happening. You never know, we might catch something, but if the kids one is tomorrow, probably Saturday would be the best day to come. Saturday and Sunday. Waiting for the music. We're in St. George's Square. This is where they, they're gonna go past here. They've been playing like, Crazy music, full blast. So this is where you would sit. I think it's... Uh Some lights come on here. Republic Street. Still a bit early. I don't think they're this one. This one seems to be always closed lately. In the evening. I must be losing, but there seems to be not very much business around. Cafe Cordina. That's what it's gonna be anyway guys. The carnival starts tomorrow. Kids carnival. Let's walk up a little bit of the uh, it is this quiet. Lady Victoria, Queen Victoria. <laughs> when I collect in the carport. Oh no, it's Republic Street. A bit darker and they will see it nice. Let's walk up a bit. See if there's anything else. Huh? It was a bit dismal. I expected more. It's deafening this music. It's gonna be fun though.
can do that. Here's a job. One, two, testing. Come on, let's walk down the straight street. Nothing much happening. I thought I uh, might come across some carnival people, but there's nothing. It's the most of the restaurants just setting up now. I'll have walked down Straight Street if we don't catch any music. This is the back end here. Where they... And the float will go in from the front. It's a good way, that. It's a, it's a nice idea. These are very historic fountain on both sides. So let's walk down... Many restaurants now, down this area. Copyright music. Look at these flowers. <laughs> This straight street goes. Very quiet. Let's walk down. See how the how my toilet is doing. Oh, they cleaned it up a bit. Still left that glass. But they put the curtain back there. I think they cleaned it up a bit after my video. Anyway, this is straight street. Watch out for the music. Actually, it's a bit nicer the other way, but um, let's walk down a bit. You can go up those stairways, that's uh, Strada Strezza, Straight Street. The cut, it's got many names. This was. Uh, a nice area if you were as a sailor in the old days. Well, some didn't open yet. It's uh, still five o'clock. Quite a few poshy places now. This is a boutique hotel, I think they're opening up. Oh, this is a restaurant. There is one, but oh no, that is a it is a hotel, I think, as well. I've no idea, keep your mouth shut, Steve. Anyway, quiet. Eve of the carnival, and it's dead. Let's see what happens tomorrow, eh? Hey? We're going with the music. I'll leave it there. It was a bit of a flop, I think, the museum. He said, we're not, we haven't got a museum. We've got a show of carnival dresses. Anyway, guys, take care. See you on the next one. Carnival.